Hey everyone, it's Erin's Life here, and this is going to be a little bit different of a series that I'm doing over the next couple of weeks in August. Um, I've never done a series like this before, and it's going to be very, very exciting because we are going to be doing a series all about my first workbook. Now, there's a couple reasons why I'm doing this. One, I honestly think it will be a fun series here on my channel. Not only because it's different because you guys are used to the vlogs and everything, but it also doesn't fit my category of, you know, spirituality with balance creation or art with star sketch. So I figured why not do it on my vlog channel to give you guys more content and also, um, you know, it's just the perfect place to do it because it's about my life and my workbook is part of my life, so all that. But also, I'm preparing for, um, in the next couple of weeks or so, I'm going to be starting to run two of my own groups based on the book, uh, teaching people my age and older about how to get their life back on track. And I figured that this series would also give me a heads up of like, you know, kind of preparation for it, just kind of have fun here on the channel with it. And then once I'm ready for the for the group to start, it'll be more professional, obviously. But what we're going to be doing in these videos are the same exact things I'm going to be doing with my groups um, that'll be, you know, with the program that I'll be working with. Um, so that's really exciting. And I thought that this would be, again, just a nice way for me to practice before I do that actual group. Um, but yeah, basically what we're going to be doing over the next few weeks of August is we are going to basically get our life back on track. I thought that this would be a perfect time to do this because everyone's trying to get back into their normalcy right now with the pandemic happening. And ironically, I didn't know that this pandemic was happening, obviously, when I, you know, published my workbook at the time. A lot of the pandemic stuff was happening in China still and everything, and nobody really knew that it was going to grow to the United States like this. And so, I honestly, I feel like my intuition was right about releasing this workbook at that time because that's when things started to, you know, really start to become reality of this pandemic. And now being in August, I feel like we kind of are used to this whole new normal in a way that I feel like it's time for us to, you know, get motivated again, get back into life and really revamp our life with these new values and our new ways of living. Um, so that's kind of the reason behind this whole group and these videos will be going out pretty much every Tuesday and Saturday. So make sure that your post bell notification is on for it. Um, episode one will actually not be up until Thursday of this week on the 4th, or Tuesday, I'm sorry, Tuesday, tomorrow. Um, I kept thinking that it's Thursday, but no, Tuesday um, it will be tomorrow, the first day. It's crazy. And then Saturday will be episode two, and then it'll basically be six episodes. So it only lasts a couple of weeks, and then my conclusion to the whole thing will be on Tuesday the 25th. So pretty much this whole entire month, we are just going to be getting our lives together. And this is just a quick intro video um, all about it. But we are actually gonna go into a little mini exercise for you all to do to prepare yourselves for tomorrow when we have episode one. You can get it done tonight or tomorrow. Um, make sure you do get it done before you watch episode one, okay? So now, let's get into the little exercise to prepare you for the rest of the series. Alright, the little activity we're going to be doing before you watch episode one is deciding your why. So, what this means is your why is your mission. And your why is, um, like I said, essentially your mission. And finding your why is not about finding your role in your life. Although that could be a big part of it, one why can spawn multiple paths, meaning it isn't one thing that you're trying to achieve. Your why is bigger than your role. It is the backbone of why you want to change your life. 
Once you discover your own personal why, your life will become more meaningful and fulfilling because you understand your reason for getting your life together. So that's why I want everyone here, whoever's watching this, to decide your why before you start this uh, series of, you know, changing your life because... I feel like when, uh, the times that you get unmotivated or the times that you get frustrated during the series whenever you're trying to, you know, fix up your life, um, I feel like that going back to this why, going back to your mission will help you to pretty much motivate you and inspire you to keep going with this. So my why for writing the workbook, um, so this is just an example for you all to use when you're creating your why. To teach new ways to clean up others' lives in a new perspective by providing activities to practice and to encourage others to continue to use these practices in their daily routine. So basically what I basically said was the things I was going to be doing and how I was going to do it and what other people will gain from it. So there's three aspects in there. So. One thing I do want you all to do before you write out a why of why you want to do this in the first place, I want you to journal out the answers to these questions. Number one, what habits do you want to incorporate into your life and what habits do you want to break in your life? This is a very important question, especially when it comes to changing up your life is there's going to be things that you're going to want to add, but of course with change, there's some things that need to be released. Number two, how do you spend your time? Like, what is your ideal day and week and year? What, what does it look like to you? And number three, what aspects of your life do you need to work on? Is it your home life? Is it your environment? Is it the way that you do your job? Is it your time management? Is it um, your organizational skills? It could literally be anything in your life that you need to work on. Um, so answer these questions and then once you answer these questions you're going to basically put them into a sentence like I did for my why um, and that is going to be your why to help you during the rest of this series. So I'd highly recommend you to create your why before you begin the series and if you feel so called to make sure you comment down below your why and I'll I can critique you I can give you any advice that you have and again if you have any questions also leave those down in the comment section down below because I would love to answer you guys' questions. So I hope you guys are excited for this series and without further ado go create your why and I will see you guys all in tomorrow's episode. Bye!